Alright, g'day fellas, my name's Austin Khan, welcome back to more of Call of Duty Black Ops 3 uh, Campaign Part 2, we're still up to the second mission um, I do apologise, last episode went for 49 minutes But we'll see how it goes, thank you for watching the previous video now available on the channel would also and also on the playlist Today's date is the 2nd of October 2023, it's Monday, public holiday, it's Labor Day But this video will be uploaded throughout the week uh, stay safe, excuse me for a minute, sorry about that. Uh, stay safe, stay healthy, until then let's do this. You got a new cyber ability to play with. Immolation. You just spit on those enemies ahead. <laughs> the most fun you can have with your pants on, right? Keep it up! What? I died already? How do you like this? Watch him burn! Hell yeah! Just like your other core systems, you select your loadout. Use these systems to seize the tactical advantage, whatever the opposition. Okay, I've loaded a second cyber ability into your core. Fireflies, a swarm of incendiary nanobots. Let them loose and see what they can do. No like you. I was gonna say I might change different loadout. Let's do this one. Let's get some ammo as well. Cool. They're using smoke grenades. Switching to your EV helps whenever you're blind, whether in the dark or in smoke. How about that? Now you never have to worry about what's lurking in the darkness.
yet. Let's move. I got bots moving that rail car. Shred them. Nice work. Hunting. Interface with that door for me. What is this place? This. This is where it all went down. The computer over there should give us some insight into how they got the explosives on board. Go interface. Security robots. They brought the explosives on board. All right, fellas. I do hope you're enjoying the uh, campaign videos as well. You want to hear something ironic? The reality was the terrorist attacks actually accelerated the development of the Winslow Accord neural network initiative. If it wasn't for the fear of attacks like this one. Probably wouldn't even have the cyber soldier program. Hang in there. 
725. Got about five minutes. You've been here before, New Blood. Let's see if you can change history. All robots should be considered hostile. Trust me, they'll consider you as much. Takedown is another one of your cyber abilities. Try it out on those bots. Watch your flank. They're coming through the windows. Nice takedown. Right on the butt. The whole thing's booby trapped. If I hack it, try to move it, or detach the car, it's gonna blow. It's too much! Even with the computer in my head, there's not enough time! It's actually very simple. Wait. This is a maglev train. If I reverse the polarity on just this car... can be expected. I expect better. You should know that. Welcome back. You're being prepped for surgery now. It's gonna be okay. Hendrix wasn't even injured on the mission. He volunteered for this. Alright, finally. That was quite a long mission. I do apologize. I was gonna keep recording, but we would have recorded for an hour. 
The increasing prevalence of drones and combat robots has significantly reduced the reliance on human infantry. As I said before, we have no further comment to make at this time. We will continue to explore avenues of diplomatic negotiations. The WA have denied sending troops to the region, stating that they are still seeking a diplomatic solution to the standoff. We are coordinating closely with our allies in order to provide tactical support where needed. How long have we been doing this, Hendricks? Five years, give or take. Sounds about right. You ever think about where we're going next? Nope. You know me. I just go with the flow. Alright, mission accomplished. Go for some XP, got a new outfit, got a new weapon. The ICR, that's a really good weapon in multiplayer. Nice. Level 5, that's cool. So we can actually uh, uh, do our own attachments for the weapons in the campaign and multiplayer and zombies, which is really cool. Mostly campaign and multiplayer. Alright, cool. Nice, level 4. Alright, here we are. So this is the uh, the train, I guess. We have collectibles. Let's see what we got. Collectibles. Personal touch. Super premium liquor. Let's do that one. And attach. Then we'll do that one. Do next to it. Let's do that one. Put you there. Cool. Very nice. My collectibles. Alright, wardrobes. We can actually customize our soldier. So we have Blackout, that's really cool. Got that one as well, Undercover, eh, I'm okay without the mask, that's, I think that's really cool. If not, I'll take Blackout, that's really cool. Prototype, much better. Alright, Body, Undercover, and Blackout, let's stick with Prototype, change character, we can either pick male or female, but we'll stick with what we got. Alright, Data Vault, what's this one? Interesting. Oh, this is where we can like have a look at our stuff. Calling card. Calling cl cards. You can customize that. Default. Oh, multiplayer. So we got, this is the, some of the uh, calling cards I got, which is really cool. Default. That's awesome. Let's do this one. Nice. Weapons are cool. Gallery. Very cool. Cool. All right, now we head over to hey, Cybercore Station. Hendricks. Where are we again? Singapore, one of my favorite places, apart from all the ones I actually like. We've got an appointment with our new LNO inside the quarantine zone. Oh yeah, this is a CIA op. This is their safe house. Glad you remember. I hope you also remember how I feel about the CIA watching over our every move. Uh, they're always watching, Hendricks. You should know that. I think you're just getting grumpier with age. All right, cyber cores. Cyber core station. View and upgrade your cybernetic combat abilities. This will definitely come in handy, um, especially when we head over to more harder missions. Control, smoke screen, misdirection. What does that say? Hack enemy combat sensors to simulate an airborne combat robot attack. Oh, that's cool. And emulation source, circuits to power. What do we have? Smoke screen. Oh, I like that one. Let's do that one. Unlock. Control, hack to enemies, combat, augmentations. Ah, let's do that one. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Let's do that one. Alright, next up, what do we got? Armor Rays. This is where we can uh, customize our weapons. Level 5, personalized camo. Oh, we got multiplayer as well, but I think I already did that. Uh, Arctic, got Black Market as well. Extras, Nuke Town, Cosmic. That's really cool. I think we'll stick with this one. I think we're okay. What do we have? Suppressor. 
extended mag and we can do the this one oh i like the grip we'll do the grip and then we've got extended mag all right pistol what we got quick draw laser sight fast mags let's do that one tactical rig sensory let's do that one cool all right that's our weapon for the day or for the campaign I should say all right we're about to check it let's go up here I haven't been up here before with this chilling cool all right so over here mission record vault interesting oh I got some challenges that's cool mission accomplished performance select mission all right so next mission is called in darkness five years later in cooperation with the CIA investigate the sudden silence of a CIA black station in the Singapore quarantine zone established in the wake of it of the disaster that killed 300,000 people all right cool so that's the mission all right so we'll go back to there and go to in darkness cool and we'll go back to here let's do it and of course you do need internet access to play black ops 3 campaign multiplayer and zombies local CIA black stations gone dark set up in the wake of the Singapore disaster the station was tasked with keeping an eye on the local operations since the wall went up and the authorities abandoned evacuation efforts the place has been pretty much run by the dominant criminal organization, the 54 Immortals. Tell me what you got from the CIA. The data package covered the whole sordid history. Explosion at the old coalescence facility killed 300,000. Evacuation and reclamation efforts were abandoned in the wake of the superstorm. So what's so important here that the CIA has to send us in to investigate? The Immortals have known links to the CDP and its ally. Weapons and tech smuggling, mostly. No wonder the CIA are All right, here we go. This mission is called In Darkness. Might do another one, but we'll see how we go. Singapore, quarantine zone. Oh, man. I can't even begin to tell you how good this tastes. After those nasty MREs we've been living on, this tastes like heaven. You know, you could get a mod that makes everything taste good. Uh, if I did that, I'd never get to appreciate the real thing. Not fucking around, are we? All right, this is as far as we go. All right, let's get to work. this lawless shithole, we can actually feel good about our by any means necessary mandate. When the full force of the storm hits, we'll be looking at 150 mile per hour winds. Take this. We wouldn't want you to get blown away. Kane, moving in to scramble the 54 Immortals communication systems. Copy that, Hendrix. Afraid I'm gonna need you to make a pit stop along the way. The Immortals have already breached the Black Station. They're prepping a shipment for transport at the docks. Why would the Immortals attack a shantytown? Well, they must have had something that they wanted. If sensitive materials fall into the hands of the CDP, it could prove extremely damaging to the Winslow Accord. We're awaiting confirmation on a drone strike, but I need you to move to intercept. We have to be 100% sure. Understood. We're on our way. Activity ahead. Stay low. The Immortals run a well-established trade in human flesh. They sell people for whatever purpose you may want them. That's why they attacked the shanty town. What are they strapping to his neck? The collar makes sure they can't get away. Whoa, 
Oh, Hinton. Not our mission. There's not a lot we can do here. Kill the son of a bitch! Alright, let's do it! Follow me! Heads up! We got a technical entering the area! Grenades ain't gonna cut it! I hear you! Explosives ain't doing shit! It's armored through tough! Hostiles in the building! Third floor! Clear them out! Double time! Hit him with a swarm launcher! Son of a bitch. Immortals can lay their hands on pretty much any weaponry and gear out there. The Superstorm's winds are gonna hit harder as we move to higher ground. Get ready to plant that bolt driver and hold the fuck on. Hurry it up. We need to get out of here. Wind's picking up. Use the bolt driver. yourself! Bolt driver, now! Use your bolt driver! We are a go on drone strike. Keep alive. Strike him down. Storm's only gonna get worse. Fuck it. Kane, we're going in. Hendrix, hold position! These waves are gonna be a problem. Keep that full driver handy. Waves hitting now! Use your full driver!
storm's getting worse. This AO is going to be non viable real soon. Visibility's getting worse. Activate tactical mode so they don't get the drop on us. the cargo. Now what? I need you to interface. I'll use your DNI to extract and delete the intel. You can do that? Your DNI is connected to our central database. All transmissions are logged and tracked. Files secured and redacted. Storm's getting worse. It's pushing a derelict tanker right toward you. Got it. Thanks, Kane. I'll take the upper deck. You take the lower. Ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Well, that was fun. Now it's time to go swimming. Okay, we're approaching the comm center. We'll update when we've cleaned house. Better make it fast. We're already getting word that intel detailing precise weaknesses in our allies' troop strength has been leaked to the CDP. This will inevitably lead to heavy losses on our side. We need to put a lid on this. Understood. I've also heard that the that the uh, the campaign's a bit confusing. Um, so what I'm gonna do is add a ending Point. explained video. Highlighting targets now. I'm gonna hit with some fireflies. All right, let's do it. Yeah, I'll be ending a, a ending explained video once the campaign's done and dusted.
Kane, we're wrapping up our sweep. Warlord, take cover! Get back! Hendrix, you hit? No, I got it! What the hell? Who's shooting? You guys okay back there? Agent Kane? I thought I told you to stay up top. Seemed like you could use some help. Besides, you two made so much noise, every 54 eye foot soldier's gonna be scrambling to respond. We need to get back on track. We've gotta shut down their comms before they figure out what the fuck's going on. Follow me. After you. Lockdown. They routed all comms through a secondary relay. Can you locate it? Uh, give me a second. Got it. We should be able to upload the scrambler from there. We'll regroup at the black station. Sounds like a plan. Let's move. I mean, I don't know if I really need to. Do anything. I think we're okay with the weapon, but I just want to change the sight just in case. So, Kane, what's the plan once we reach the black station? Strike and strip. Your DNI means you guys are basically walking data drives. We upload all data to you, then wipe everything. What about the evac for any survivors? Facts are, the station went dark. It was raided by the dominant militarized force in this territory. It's likely there won't be any survivors. Okay. We're approaching the comms relay. It's heavily defended. Get to work on that relay. Make sure these sons of bitches can't talk to each other. Kane, comms are coming down as we speak. Where are you? Got eyes on the black station. It's swarming with 54 immortals. Sending you an updated RP to your HUD. On our way. We done here? We're done. Structure's unstable. Could break apart at any point. Watch out, Pinkett! That building's coming down! Watch your step! You don't want bad weather to be part of your epitaph! to believe people still live here. They're still on site, trying to grab everything they can before the worst of the storm hits. What do you suggest? I suggest we hit him before the storm does.
all just gonna die back there, bloody hell. Kane, we got eyes on the black station. Okay, let's find out what we're dealing with here. What the hell tore through here? Something left in a hurry. Kane. Could be 54i grunt detonations. Yeah, maybe if the doors were blown in, but they're blown out. Something up ahead. Get ready. You hear that? There's someone in there. We need this door open now. Let's go. There's no need for brute force. Sometimes you just need to knock. Holy fuck. Turn that shit off. In a what the fuck is this, Kane? Running a search now. Denial of reincarnation. Perpetrated by Jay Zhang. 54 Immortals Enforcer. It was an execution method reserved for their worst enemies. Performed while they were still alive. Oh no. That's not good. What? Something else? They data drives. They're gone. Surveillance footage, reports, debriefs, everything we came here to download and clear. Local hard copy of a CIA black site provides a daily sync with ongoing CIA global activity. If that gets out... It would compromise every CIA operation around the world. What about the drives tracker? <laughs> Biodomes. The heart of 54 Immortals operations and home of brother-sister team and leaders, Go Min and Go Zhulon. So let's go get our drives and give them a little payback. I don't think the Immortals killed these people. You saw the doors blasted from the inside. You saw them drilling. They never made it inside this room. So who do you think did it? I mean, who else had access to this? The last recorded operation at this station involved a Winslow Accord Black Cyber Ops unit. It was John Taylor's team. What? You think they had something to do with these murders? There's no fucking way, Kane. Look, I know Taylor. There's no way he'd turn on his own. Oh, looks like he went rogue. Or Taylor, I should say, went rogue. All right. Well, that that will have to be the end of chap of part two of Call of Duty Black Ops Three campaign. I'll be back with one more video uh, for the day, but I'll be back on it's tomorrow Tuesday. I'll be back on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. The reason I usually I was gonna work, I was gonna do it on a Wednesday, but because I'm working, I decided to do it on Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I've got this weekend off, so that will be great. I've got some more attachments for the weapons. That's cool. 
Nice. So we're about to get back to the uh, back to the headquarters or base, whatever you, whatever you want to call it. Before so, we go, uh, I wanted to ask you. Kane thinks Taylor's behind the Black Station hit. Shouldn't their DNI show her exactly where they are? Kane said they're off the grid. They must have found a way to disable their DNI tracking. I'm not so sure. I think our LNO is keeping something back from us. I think you're being paranoid. I read her file. She's been through some bad ops, heavy situations. Lived through it all. I think she's being straight with us. I guess we'll see. Alright, so anyway, before I stop the video, we've got the this one over here, which is the one we're up to. We've got, uh, we'll stick with the enhanced overdrive, that'll be great. Um, org breakdown, yeah, I think we'll stick with Marshall. Alright, I'll head back to the uh, weapons, because I want to customise my weapon, change the, uh, the scope. Recon, that's cool. Uh, let's do this one. Let's do that one. All right, what else we got? Long barrel. I like the extended mags. That's okay. Long barrel increases range. That's a tough one. Um, yeah, I don't know. We'll stick with that one. All right, pistol. What do we got? Pistol's okay. All right, fellas. Well, thank you very much for watching part two of Call of Duty Black Ops Three campaign. And of course, I'll be back with another video for part three. So yeah, enjoy the video. Stay safe, stay healthy. Until then, I'll see you next episode. Peace out, mate.